Elite Soul Family was good. This is for, um, hello everybody, I'm Yami. How are you? <laughs> so this is for, this is, a, this is a thought that had prophetic thought, prophetic, you know, word for you guys. So there's going to be a lot of people in your new season who are going to all of a sudden start supporting you. And it's not going to be in the, they're not going to be supporting you when you were going through, you know, the beginning stages. They're going to be, you know, hop on the bandwagon, so to speak. Once they see people of influence supporting you. Get where I'm going with this. They're only going to support you once they see people of influence supporting you. Or they're only going to be supporting you once they see people that they want to be attached to supporting you or being genuine friends with you. So be very mindful of people, family, friends, mothers, cousins, the whole nine yards, only supporting you, only wanting to seemingly be attached to you. And this, and this, and this, I got this vision too, like someone out to dinner or someone out to lunch or someone at an event and it was actually dinner. You were out to dinner and you were sitting at the table with people of influence, high ranking people. This might be social media influencers. It might be um, industry behind the scenes people, but those people are very important. They run the industry. People, the people behind the scenes in the industry run the industry. I'm talking about entertainment industry. And you were out to dinner with these people. And um, when you were out to dinner, this person that you knew for years, you know them for years and you're not cool with them anymore, but you know them for years and they came up to your table and when they came up to your table, they tried to make it a facade, like masquerading as if you two were the best of friends. So they came up to you, talking to you, and this person too, they weren't in the they weren't in the entertainment industry, but they were like, you know, maybe like a fashionista type energy. And they came up to you, but they didn't really they don't really get attention. They never really got like the clout, so to speak. You know what I mean? So they came up to you. Or it might just be someone who owns a business. You get what I'm going with this. So they came up to you. I'm sorry. They came up to you and they were like, oh, hey, girl. Hey, guy. Da, da, da. And you were like, hi. And they were like, oh, don't act like that. What's good? How you been? And you're like, what? <laughs> your, your, your response is very much like, what? And, and all your friends at the table knew what it was giving. Not, they didn't, and they didn't take your energy the wrong way. They knew your response. They, they know your character now. They know your character, know who you are. So they know, like, he wouldn't act like this or she wouldn't act like this to just anybody. You know? Even a stranger who would, came up to you and said, because in, in the vision, you were in the public eye and you were famous. So in the vision... You were well known. You were out there. You were, you know, high ranking, powerful person in, in the industry. And they know how you would have reacted to someone who you genuinely did not know. And how genuine you would have been to the person you did not know. So they know, like, if someone comes, is coming up to you and they're acting like, you know, oh, hey, how you been? How you doing? And you're like, hey. <laughs> you're like, how are you? And actually, in the vision, you didn't even say, how are you? They were like, how you been? You were like, this is your phone. You were like, now, mind you, you and your friends are out to dinner. <laughs> and this can go for any scenario, but this is the vision I got in my head. You, you and your friends are out to dinner. You're sitting at a table, like a booth. And the table's in front of the booth. They were like a round booth. You know what I mean? And these are shorts. It's not underwear. <laughs> and this is a round booth. And late for days. I'm sorry. And it was a round booth. And you guys were sitting, and um, one of your friends whispers in your ear something, and then the rest of the table goes, okay, thanks, have a nice day. The table, your friend stuck up for you. And the person who came up to the table now kind of like goes off, right? You know, goes off like, how you act like that? And your friends say, oh, yeah, we see to you, they're saying, oh, yeah, we understand why you did that now. You know, so people always telling themselves. So don't let anyone just, well, actually, let the energy handle it. 
Now, unless they start getting disrespectful, trying to touch you or, you know, trying to, you know, attack you in any type of way, verbally or even physically, then, of course, you do what you got to do. Um, but these new people you're going to be around, they are spiritually in tune, too. They are tapped into the spiritual realm and they can see right through all that, that fakeness of someone, com someone coming up to you that never supported you, never showed you any type of real love. And now that they see you're attached to people they want to be attached to because it will help their business grow. It will help their social media uh, presence. It will help, you know, them be in rooms that they never, ever will be in. You know what I mean? Unless they were attached to you. And they feel like because y'all might have grew up together, y'all might be play cousins, y'all might be even real cousins, y'all might, you know, be even siblings that you don't talk to. Whomever. Aunts, uncles, whoever. And now they're coming up to you <laughs> trying to, I wouldn't say clout, but that, I hate that word. That's the only word I can think of. They're trying to clout off of your image now because they see, oh, shoot, the people I want to be around are loving him or loving her and they, they want to be around her. So I got I to gotta figure out a way how to, how to, uh, how to get attached to that, that crowd now because, you know, someone I grew up with is, is in that crowd and they, we had the same opportunities and now they're there and actually they had it harder than me and now they're there and I can't be there. Oh, no, I got to, I got to, I got to. You know, you're going to encounter that. You're definitely going to encounter that. And in the vision I saw, you stayed so calm. And that's what made them upset as well. Because they thought that when they started going off saying, I know you since da 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 I helped you. Blah, 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 trying to spread your business in front of these people. They thought you were going to mirror that em energy. And you didn't. You stayed calm and you were like... I think you might even say, you done? <laughs> Anything else? <laughs> so you're going to get in contact with, you're going to be in contact with some of these people. Or, you, and, I, and I know I just said you're going to be in contact or get in contact. Maybe they might even try to call you or contact you through DM or something like that because they see now where you're going or see where you're at and they might try to contact you to get in your good graces because they already know that they might see you out and, you, and they might know you might be with so-and-so or you might be doing this. Ignore the DMs, ignore the text messages because that can be ignored. But in person, I would suggest, I would implore you to let the energy show itself, meaning let that person show their ass, I'm sorry, or, you know, show their behind, or <laughs> Woo, child. keep on scrolling. Um... I took notes. I just make sure I got everything down. Let's see. Uh, da, 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 da. Yeah. And it might be people, too, who just want to act like they want to revisit your friendship, but they don't care a crap about you. They're out for self. If they were not supporting you when they know you needed help from any type of help, any time, but and help doesn't mean monetarily, monetary help. Help can mean calling someone up and checking up on them to see if they're okay. That's help. People don't realize there's different forms of help. Help is liking a post. Help is making a small little comment on a post. Help, this comment can be a heart. If you can't even comment a heart, if you can't even like a post, then why do you think I'm going to even talk to you? If you can't respond to a tweet, if I tweet, if you tweet somebody, just, oh, you at them and put a heart or whatever, the, hypothetically, whatever, not or not hypothetically. And they can't even respond back, but you see them tweeting all day. Oh, I didn't get that tweet. Child, you live on Twitter. Or child, you live on Instagram. Child, you, you live on TikTok. You are, you are TikTok. And our friendship has TikTok. Video or comment or share. Thank you.